Muguruza serves. It's a double. And it's over. And Sophia Kennan goes from child prodigy to Australian Open champion. Last year, I felt like I was playing good. Um, I just came here. I didn't have really any expectations. I obviously wanted to do well. I knew that I was playing well. I started having you know, a good run and everything. You know, So it's not like I was ranked 100 and all of a sudden I won. We have none other than the defending champion, Sophia Kenin. She's taking on Kaya Kanepi. Yeah, I feel like everyone was always asking me, you know, like, would you want to, like, do you possibly see yourself getting there, you know, winning again? And obviously I try, I said yes. I mean, but yeah, I mean, the, with the way I'm playing, no. Yet another backhand error from Sophia Kennan. She's usually so strong on that wing. Obviously way too nervous, but uh, I just couldn't execute my shots. She wants to hit the big winner, but she's missing by a long way. She just needs to dial it back a fraction. I knew I was going to have pressure. I knew I was going to you know, have like emotions, nerves, everything all together. Sophia Kennan clinging on to her crown at the moment. I obviously felt like I'm not there 100%, you know, physically, mentally. My game, everything just feels like really off. Obviously, it's not good. And ace number 10 finishes it off. What a way. Kaya Kanepi defeats the reigning champion, Sophia Kenin. I'm not obviously used to this, so uh, right now, what's up in mind? I just got to figure out how to, you know, play at that level that I played at. Felt like I was expected to do well and obviously didn't, so uh, that's um, the difference for me.